Yo, what's up guys? I hope you're having a good day out there today. We got a great video on deck and I'm very excited to bring it to you guys. Today, we are going to bring back, where did I put it? There it is, the deodorant stick. Now, <clears throat> we can't use this one because, well, let's just say I was feeling a little festive. We had a little bit too much fun that night. So what we're gonna do today is I'm gonna show you how to make your own deodorant stick properly. And I, hopefully I won't burn my hand this time. We shall see. Uh, also, what else, what else, what else? Oh, we got a couple quick updates. OTR bullet stickers. I only have a few of these left, guys. So if you guys want some, uh, be sure to specifically ask for them when you get your order. Just email artprimo.com at gmail.com, artprimo.com at gmail.com. Hit us up. We only got a few left, so don't sleep on it. No guarantee there are going to be any left, but you never know. You might get lucky. Uh, also, I want to give a shout out to the homie Yex for sending me these lovely slaps. These are really, really nice. Uh, he sent me about 10 or 12 of these, and uh, that's usually what I prefer. Send me your best. That way, when it goes out, you're showing your best. Or, if you want to send a lot, send mass-produced stickers. Uh, think like Obey Giant. Say what you want about him. He got up with slaps. And that is another way. It is another way. So, um, what else? Oh, squeaky wheel gets the grease, homie. Squeaky wheel gets the grease. Look at that. All right, guys. So this came from Flat Black Shop. Flat Black Shop. One of our wholesale customers. Did you know that we do wholesale, homie? So if your shop doesn't carry our stuff, let them know. Send them our way. We would love to lace them with AP stuff. Because you know what? I got to eat, player. And this stuff tastes like crap. Anyways, so let's see what Flat Black sent us because they are the homies. They are the homies. And I'll put a link below for Flat Black because you give me love, I give you love back. I wear the shirt, we rep you, you rep us. It is a reciprocal relationship, reciprocal. Whoa, that is tight. Look at that. It's my Ruka. Um, what else is in here? Ooh, I think this is a flat black shirt as well too. Let's let's open up the shirts in a second because I heard there's some slaps in here. And you all you all all y'all just want to see slaps. I know how it is. You guys just want to see all these slaps that we get in all the time. You know, we could go back 20 years in time and the kids they just love stickers. They want to see stickers. They want to get stickers in their orders. Um, I will definitely be putting some of these. These are very high quality slaps in here and um, oh, look at that. Well, thank you, Flat Thank you, Flat Black, for lacing us with all these great slaps. Wow, there's some good ones. Look at that one. Look at that one right there, Flat Black Shop. Their graphics are off the hook, dude. These are fantastic. So these will definitely be going in people's orders, but you gotta ask. Remember, you gotta ask for that hit off. It's not an automatic thing. Anyway, let's take a look at my shirts. I'm an XL, by the way, if you wanna send me some shirts. Ooh, yeah, look at that. Ooh, high quality cotton. Let's see there. Oh yeah, look at that. That's tight. I will definitely be repping that. It's our wholesale customer. They work with us. All right, let's take a look here. Oh yeah, look at that. She is cool. I'd hang out with her. We'd kick it, we'd kick it. Yes, we would. Uh, thank you very much, Flat Black. I really appreciate you sending me those shirts. That is very kind of you. And I will rep them with pride because they look good on me, and I look good on you. All right guys, the first thing you wanna do is take the skin off of the hobo marker because it will not melt into the streaker, which we learned because I, well, let's just say I forgot about that part in the last video. So make sure you take the skin off and go ahead and take the deodorant out of the deodorant stick and you know, try to clean off as much of that as you can. Uh, doesn't really matter that much, but you know, go ahead and clean it up. Now I'm using what's called a heat gun to do this. You could also do it on the stove. There isn't a lot of really gnarly solvents involved in this, so it's, it's probably fine, but if you're nervous about it, just go ahead and wear a respirator. I'd say this is no more dangerous than heating up some Fimo. That said, you know, use caution, be smart. Um, and, uh, you know, if you're worried, do it outdoors, but yeah, just go ahead and fill it up. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Fill it up. Let it dry and you're good to go. Hey, chill out, home.
not the smoothest writing marker, but it just, it writes on anything. I mean, rusty, rough, uh, wet, oily, it doesn't matter. The hobo will cut through. But what better thing to do than to stick three of them together and create one fat marker? Now, there are some disadvantages to fat markers. For example, those of you who have used the Molotov Masterpiece marker know what I'm talking about. Because nature, or the surfaces you're going to be writing on, the world, it's, it's three-dimensional. You know, it's not flat like a piece of paper. So if there's a small imperfection, the wider the nib, the greater the imperfection of the surface will be exaggerated. You know what I mean? So sometimes you do have to go back and just touch it up a little bit because the marker doesn't quite catch. But if you get that, if you get the nib, I guess we call this a nib, the tip of it, if you get the tip worn just right, you create a nice perfect chisel. And if you, as long as you maintain that chisel, you're gonna get really, really nice writes with it. Now, I know a lot of you guys already are asking, what about the solid marker? What about the solid marker? Yes, we will do one of those too. I thought it'd be a lot of fun to just try something really cheap, cheap deodorant, cheap streakers, and just see what we could make with it. Now, you guys at home, I'm sure you wanna try it too, so you know what? I made a kit for you. I already have a kit, check it out. Three hobos an empty deodorant stick, brand new, never had any deodorant in them. You know you can buy these empty, right? In black too, tuxedo black, and a little scribe and some slaps. So I'm gonna have a kit below, and remember, when you're watching these videos, do click on the description, because I always put links below to get this stuff, because hey, I know you wanna go out there and paint, so why don't you do it? Be sure to hit like, be sure to hit subscribe, be sure to blah, 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 bl